Let's do it. Senior detective. I am 32 on Friday, so. Oh my god, this is fucking ancient. Oh, I'm excited. Painting, got it. That frame rate, man. Hi, I have a reservation under Nancy Drew. Konnichiwa, yoyakarimasu. That kimono lady was like, Nancy Drew? Fuck Nancy Drew, man. <laughs> it only fell. It oh, she not. said Obasan. You know better. I'm very sorry. She, she's just a little upset. She does not want her here. Tell her to go. Now. Bye. What was that about? Why is she upset? Please, don't worry about that. Here, this is your room key. Okay. Let me, um... Let's see. We should be able to stretch this out a little bit. Thanks for the key. Ryokan Hie. Oh yeah, this is actually what it says. Nijuyon, room 24. Thanks. Your room is on the second floor. I've already had your bags sent up. Please, my name's Miwako. Miwako. Come to me if there's anything you need. That's what we've been hearing. Is that a robotic cat? Is that a robotic cat? Yeah, Suki. Suki. Isn't she the greatest? Lentalo got her for me. I've wanted my own pet cat for forever, but I can't have one at the ryokan. <laughs> I came into work one day, and there she was, right next to the sweetest note from Lentaro. Lentaro. I've never seen a robotic cat before. What does it do? She's not on it. She's Suki. It's okay, she didn't mean it. <laughs> Actually, she doesn't really do much, mainly sits. But, oh wait, I just learned something neat. Suki, tate. Stand? He's standing. Oh, that's great. That's all I remember right now, but she can do a lot more. I should figure out what the rest of the commands are, come to think of it. Although, to be honest, it's a little more believable if she just does what she wants. <laughs> Your grandma must be very upset about the portrait breaking. What's a ryokan? Talk to you later. Your grandmother seemed very upset about the portrait breaking. It's no big deal. She thinks it's a bad sign that the portrait fell from the wall. Why is that? It's a very special portrait. It's one of the two remaining images of my mother and it was taken shortly before... It's one of my grandmother's favorite portraits. What's a ryokan? It's a hotel. What is a ryokan? Ryokan is almost exactly like a hotel or a spa. But far more traditional. They're fucking great. This ryokan has been in my family for generations. Passed down from mother to oldest daughter in order to preserve the traditional style, the food, the caretaking. Every little detail is as it would have been generations ago. How long has the ryokan been in your family? A very long time. My grandmother says it has been passed down since the early 1700s. So one day you'll pass this place on to your daughter? That must be very nice. Well, I'm the younger daughter. My older sister Yumi will be the one to take over the ryokan. Oh. My grandmother's offering a few classes in traditional arts. She's in room 18 at the end of the hall. Hmm. Um, yeah, if you ever travel to Japan and you get the choice to choose, you get the chance to choose between hotel or ryokan, Go ryokan, because they're so nice. They're like more traditional. The buildings are like traditional. You sleep like on actual ftons and not like Western style beds and everything. And the surface is always really, really good. Really nice. What happened, what to, your happened to your mother? I shouldn't bother you with our problems, Nancy. Please, it is very nice outside. A perfect time to relax and enjoy your surroundings. Okay. What's the sign say? Doru. <laughs> Doru-sama. Yeah, so this is another thing. Um, 
when you go to a ryokan, like a really traditional ryokan, I've only had it happen like once or twice, they'll have a sign like this at the entrance that'll say like who their current guests are, who they're expecting. So it usually is like, welcome pers these people. Like, so this is like, we have Drew staying here, Williams, Schneider, Mueller, and Herman are staying at the ryokan right now. Um, I think, I don't know why, but I think it's just like to make sure that they know like that you're welcome and if they see you in the hallway they'll be like oh in this case drew they'll be like oh drew good to see you and how are you, how was your stay and blah blah, blah. it's like it's so nice <laughs> Ryuyamazu, Schneida, Mura and Herman so this is super accurate actually so far i'm impressed Nancy please be careful there's too much broken glass Seems like the team really did their re research. They probably traveled to a ryokan in Japan and like based their game on that. Oh, phone call. Is it this one? Hello. Nancy, you made it. How was your ride? It was pretty good. I love Japan. I have done so much shopping and George's convention is crazy. <laughs> I've never seen so many people. It's totally sold out. You sound pretty excited. Well, yeah. Kind of hard not to be here. I don't even know where to start. Have you ever had mochi? No. It's a revelation, Nancy. I'm not even kidding. And the shopping. Conference me in already. Oh, yeah. Did that do it? No? Okay. <laughs> no, hit the... No, the... You do it, then. We all on? Yes. Yep. Why That's is the it best. so hard? It so isn't. <laughs> anyway, what's your story? What are you up to? You coming over? I'm still getting settled in, but I'll be out to see you guys soon. How's the... whatever it is you're the saying? The Ryokan. Ryokan. It's great. Ryokan. A little strange, though. When I was checking in, a picture fell off the wall, and everyone was really weird about it. Huh. Oh no, our train's going to be here in a sec. Gotta go. See you, Nancy. Bye. That was fucking great. God, what a lovely dialogue. That was really fun. Anything we can look at here? So, the our uh, magnifying glass will be yellow or red if we can interact with something, right? So if we see anything fishy... This... This isn't really anything a Ryokan would have, though. This is, like, highly idealized. Um, if you if you find a place that has an inner garden like this, you hit the fucking jackpot. Let me tell you that. Who's playing the drums? I feel like I'm uh, going to war. Okay, I don't see anything here. So is there any way we can? Oh, ah, so that's how we get to the side. Well, I don't see anything. What's this? Door rattles. I have no idea where I'm going. Didn't she say my room was on the... Culture of room lessons. Oh, can we go in? Nancy-san, please sit. It is a pleasure oh. to meet you parapali. I am sorry for the way I behaved when you first arrived. It was very impolite. Please, forgive me. Of course, don't worry. It's nice to meet you as well. That I don't is trust her. very kind of you to say, but I must always worry about the guests who stay with us, especially Sate? now. What do you mean, especially now? Are you here for a lesson today? Um, the other lady at the front desk, her Japanese accent was really convincing, but this lady, I'm like, nah, <laughs> nah. -uh. A lesson? I offer lesson in traditional arts to anyone interested in learning. I have much to show you. Uh, I'd rather ask you a few Actually, questions. Actually, I'd rather ask you a few questions about the Ryokan. Yes, 
We will get to that. But first, today you will be learning katakana. Oh, to bring the it. Outsider, <laughs> katakana always looks far more difficult to learn than it I, is. I think I'll you be fine. You just need to be patient <laughs> and you need to learn to see more than you are used to seeing. There is a book to help in the chest. <laughs> Practice until it looks like your name, Nancy. Not just some lines. What do you mean? Although there are many Nancy's in the world, your name belongs to only you. It has always been yours. You must try until what you see on the paper is not just a word. It is you. <laughs> Nancy Doru. That's fun. How do I... Not quite. Time to try again. What? Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, they want me to... Oh. Nope, that doesn't look right. Better start again. Excuse me. So they want me to start here? It is a name, but it is not your name. Try again. How dare. <laughs> How... So I would... I would write this like this. But I think they want this. Whoops. Another mistake. Well, that's what the extra paper's for. Can I, like, quit? Fuck this shit. Fuck you, Grandma. <laughs> she fell asleep! <laughs> What's in the back? Oh. 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Locked. Yeah, we have a key. Okay, this is our room. What's that? Japan changed my life. By the end of the program, I learned so much more than I ever dreamed. Jamie. Dear teacher, thank you for teaching us English. You are the best teacher ever. We'll miss you. Japan teacher experience. Exchange. Huh. Duration of the program. Two weeks, three, four weeks, five, eight weeks. Experience the excitement of living abroad and making a difference as a teacher's side in Japan. Teacher's aid. You'll learn. you team with a certified instructor to, instructor to teach English to grade school children during the day, leaving your evenings free to explore and discover Japan. Okay. Kenta. <laughs> Dinosaurs, robots, playing tag with brothers and friends. Energetic and a bit difficult to get focused at times. He's extremely curious about the inner workings of electronics. This is cute. God, they they prepared so much. I, I doubt this is important, is it? Kuro neko aka. <laughs> cool. What's it's your name? It's teacher time. Sakura. I is Sakura. We use Japanese. I is seven. I is black hair. So... What do you want to do? Oh! Um, welcome to Ryokan Hie, where you will experience traditional Japanese culture and hospitality at its finest. Located near the base of majestic Mount Hie, our Ryokan has been offering a relaxing stay to guests since the 1700s. Ease away the day's travel with a calming soak in the hot springs. Ooh, yes. The entrance is located on the first floor hallway across from room 7, with open times changing daily for men and women. Showers for pre-washing and towels are available in the baths. For guests wishing to visit more of Kyoto, the local Misawa station offers real access to downtown. Popular tourist sites always include the Pachinko Parlor at Kure or the Exposition Center currently hosting the Technology of Tomorrow Expo at Matsue. It is suggested that guests pre-purchase their Fasca train, Fasca? train tickets before arriving at the Ryokan. Front desk is open from 7am to 1am daily. God, those are some long opening hours. 
To help with any additional needs, thank you for choosing Yokan Hie. Welcome home. Ooh, that's nice. So she said I might use this, but I don't know how to take it. Oh, that's pretty. So... What do we do? Suitcases? Oh, this is my stuff. Nihongo. Ewa Jiten. It's an English Japanese dictionary. Cool. Oh. Anything else I can take? Haska. That's the train stuff, right? I like the music. Mm, it's the same. Okay. Anything else we can do? Doesn't look it. Anything here in the front? No. So what's our goal at the moment? I don't need- <laughs> Because I'm playing as a senior detective, I don't need a task list. Oh. <laughs> did that. Sure did. Fuck. <laughs> okay. I Do you love take care the of the gardens. gardens? Do you take care of them? Yes, of course. I sleep here, but my home is out there in the gardens. Even when the whole earth is covered in snow, I am happiest there, waiting for the first flowers to break through the frost. Do yourself a favor, Nancy Son. Find a small piece of earth that begs to be made perfect and do whatever it asks of you. That's a nice thought. You will thank me. Okay. Ryokan's important to you. The Ryokan seems very important to you. The world around has become a million different things since I was a girl. And I do not have to tell you that many changes have not been so good. So good. But in here, the world does not change. Why that do you want garden. Yumi to take over the Ryokan? It is tradition. Any other reason? I am used to this question. Tradition is very often made fun of or ignored. Really? But tradition is how we know ourselves, Nancy Son. The <laughs> traditions of your family are how you know yourself. Tradition is a burden in many ways. I understand this. But imagine not knowing who you are His or music. where you come from. It would be very lonely, I think. His music is like she's challenging us. Have it's like you it's about to like the climax into a Since fist fight. I was born. Have you ever left? I have. But I never found anywhere I wanted to be as much as here. Okay, I'd I like think we have to again. try this again. Um, I feel like... I want to clarify, though, I am joking, of course, when I call her a little bitch. <laughs> People like to take stuff out of context. I'm just having fun with the game. <laughs> okay, that was good. I think it's mostly about just, like, staying in the lines. Oh, that was a sloppy one. I feel like you guys get me, but there's always someone ready to clip stuff out of context, you know? So I just want to make sure we're clear, we're on the same page. Oh, okay. I'm doing- I'm so far now. It's hard with a mouth. <laughs> Nancy Drew is just on the staple, like grabbing the the brush, being like. <laughs> oh, I don't want to fuck it up now. I'm so far. Uh, 
Ah. Ah. I did it. Very well done, Nancy. <sighs> See, I just needed a moment. This is the best I've ever seen from a new student. Hell yeah. I knew you Only took me like, what, ten well. tries? <laughs> Leave this to dry, and I'll have it brought to your room to remind you of your success. Thanks. Have you always offered classes? No, it is new. We have developed a reputation. And for many years, I've wanted to teach our guests. Hmm. It's a nice thing to offer. I'll let you get back to work. Goodbye. Okay. <laughs> I love how she just has a thing in front of her that's like, Nancy. Like Nancy. Is there something in here? <coughs> Japanese writing. Learn the difference between hiragana and katakana. Oh, wow. This is like a whole... Damn! 46 symbols in both syllabaries, each character representing a single syllable instead of a single letter. This is all like, Jesus. They really like did their research. Japanese is typically written vertically from right to left, but it can also be written horizontally left to right. That's what they do. Oh, look. Oh, my God. This takes me back to like my first year in college. Jeez. Um, fun fact, the you know how we how we say like a b c d e f g so in japanese this is top right to left and then going down so it's akasata nahama yarawa <laughs> i had to memorize that um so you know the order so basically you know how libraries bookstores like authors are alph alphabetically ordered so if you want to find a book in Japan and you're like, okay, whatever, Kawashima, you're looking for the author Kawashima, then you have to go Akasata Naha Mayarawa. And then it's like, okay, Aka Kawashima. And then there he is. So that's how it's all organized. And then Gatakana is exactly the same, but different set of characters. And it's just, this is mostly used for loan words. So words that come like, for example, from English, which they have a ton. I remember Sean asking me recently the word for pineapple, for example, in, in Japanese is pineapple. So you would write that with these characters. So you would go ha, and then you put a little circle on top and that makes it pa. And then pa i, so this one, then an n, this one, pine. And then we get a put but I can't. There's no like, there's a couple things needed for that that I can't show you here. But you get the gist. Can I put it back? There we go. More calligraphy! <laughs> Yay! Oh god, no. Pi. Not. Oh, I made a mistake. It's this one. Pineapple. There you go. That's pineapple. <laughs> it actually looks pretty legit. <laughs> pineapple. Does anyone want me to write anything? Now's your chance. How do I put it back? Oh, okay. Use the use the word generator. <laughs> use the word generator. The channel points. Write your name. Um, my actual name, Ev Ev Evelyn, Jesus, Eberin. So that would be this. That's my name, Eberin. Eberchan. <laughs> Smolders? That's easy. S mo du da. There we go. Smoridasu. This is fun. <laughs> My handwriting is pretty. Thank you. Um, you want to see a really... Okay, I have to look it up though. The most complicated characters that I've ever had to learn is the characters for depression. And I think it's Yuzu, if I remember correctly. Let me see. Yuzu. 
Yeah. Oh my god. So the characters. So depression in Japanese is yutsu. But how you write it is fucking insane. Okay, here it comes. God, it's so complicated. I, I was able to write this once for a test and then I was like, well, never again. Oh, I made a mistake. Fixing. And then this one. And then this one. There you have it. Depression. <laughs> you utsu. So this part is U, double U, and then Utsu. It's so hard to write alphabet when you're thinking of Japanese. U Utsu. That's a uh, depression. I, it's a it's a depressing word, but that's like the most complicated uh, characters for the standard. So there's there's a. There's a determined number of characters. There's about 3,000 that are like considered the basics. So if you know the basics, 3,000, um, then you can basically read and write most of the stuff that happens in Japan. Like you're, you can probably get through like 95% of Japanese stuff. Um, and Yuitsu, those characters are considered some of the most complex one in that base of 3,000. But yeah, there's 80,000 Japanese characters, so... <laughs> right, Big Boss? Oh, that was always funny. I always... I remember going to the vet in Japan. Um, and they would always be like, Pika Bossa Chang! <laughs> um, I think... Big... G and then... Oh God, I haven't written in so long. Big Boss... Big boss. Oh, this sh this one should be not here. So big boss. That's it. I haven't written Japanese in so long. It's like ah, uh, this is how you write it, right? <laughs> okay, I think we've uh, dicked around long enough. More calligraphy. <laughs> that was very fun, though. This is very fun. Hello, Nancy San. I'll I stop didn't, bugging you now. I didn't want to talk Please to you. Please visit again, Nancy San. And get criticized for my Japanese again? No, thank you. <laughs> Bye. This music's so exciting. Maybe check out this corner. Ghost Stories of Japan, Volume Three. Ooh. Okiku and the Nine Plates. Near the gates of Himeji Castle is an ancient well said to be haunted by a ghost of a heartbroken woman named Okiku. Before her death, Okiku was a beautiful servant who worked for a respected samurai. The samurai quickly fell in love with Okiku, but she had no interest in her rich and powerful employer. The samurai soon grew tired of Okiku's spurning of his advances and concocted a plan to win her affections. Okiku was tricked into believing that she had broken one of the samurai's ten prized plates. Fearing for, er fearing for her life, Okiku told the samurai what had happened begging for his mercy and forgiveness. The samurai agreed to spare her life in exchange for her love. When Okiku refused, she was thrown into the Himeji castle well to drown. According to legend, Okiku's betrayal was so great and her grief so strong that her spirit cannot leave the dark confines of the well. I think I've been to that well. At least not during the day. At night, yeah, I've been to Himeji castle. I remember a ghost in a well. Like, reading a story about it. There's probably like a little sign next to it. At night, it's said that her spirit springs forth from the well and calls out one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, before being pulled back down the well by an unseen force. Spirit's counting has led many to believe that Okiku is forever trapped in that dreadful moment when she discovered the samurai's missing plate, knowing that its absence would cost her her life. Damn. Some say Okiku's ghost was finally released from the well when a neighbor loudly called out TEN during her nightly haunting. Other less optimistic tellings say that her spirit is still trapped within the well, forever living out, living out that terrible last moments of her betrayal. Yeah, I think I've been there. 
I was um, watching those documentaries. Oh. With uh, Sean, I was like, oh my god, we really need to travel to Japan again. Um, I wanna. A thing that I really still wanna see is Hokkaido. I've never been to Hokkaido, which is like northern Japan. Please don't hang anything up there. Oops. Um, and beginning of the year, they do a big ice festival Hi. where they do like ice carving and stuff. And I really want to see that. That's like on my bucket list. Can't interact with the kitty. Hi. Okay, I'll we stop exhausted. bugging you now. Bye. I'll dialogue with her. We didn't look at this corner yet. Kyoto Famous Gardens Visitor Guide. Oh. Ryoanji! Yeah, I've been to Ryoanji. <laughs> Nestled in the northwest corner of Kyoto sits Ryoanji. I used to live really close to there. Uh, I, I lived right next to the Golden Pavilion, Kinkakuji. Uh, it is here visitors can rest and contemplate the mystery of one of the most famous Zen rock gardens in the world. The collection of 15 irregular stones on a bed of gravel that makes up the garden is not only world heritage sites, but it is considered by some to be one of the greatest masterpieces of Japanese culture. The art of karesansui, dry landscape gardens, is filled with symbolism, but the beginner can gain a better appreciation of the garden with a little knowledge. There are five basic stone types that are used as single stones or in combinations of to give different meanings to each arrangement. Okay. Um, Ryoanji is really cool. What I always liked about Ryoanji is that there's, it's like a, so it's a collection of 15 stones. So it's like, um, it's like an inner garden. Like you can see like the garden and then around it is like a like a wooden walkway basically that people can also sit and just look at and admire the garden. And it's just like gravel and rocks. Um, and then they put like a nice pattern in the sand. But you can never see all 15 at the same time. No matter where you sit, you can always only see 13, maybe 14. Because they're always like obscuring each other in some way, which is really cool. So there's 15, but you can never see all of them from one position, which is always fun to like mess around with a little bit, like sit in different positions and try and see them. Once the rocks are placed in the desired arrangement on the gravel, rakes are used to create lines in the gravel symbolizing water. Completed kare sansui is then ready for the viewer's contemplation. Nice. Okay. That's the glass. I think we've looked everywhere, haven't we? Oh, we can leave? Trains, parking, Kyoto, s not smoking. <laughs> no smoking allowed. Um, I need a dictionary to translate that. Oh, do you? Ah, holy shit. <laughs> That's fun. Okay. Wait, what's this? Current assignment. After a string of tough mysteries, I've decided it's time to take a break and do some little sightseeing. Taking PG Krollmeister up on his offer to send me to his favorite yokan in Kyoto, Japan. I'll spend the day teaching English. And my night with Bess and George exploring the sights, fashion, history, and nightlife of downtown Kyoto. From what I hear, the inn I'm saying it is known as... Okay. One of the scariest places in the city. I'm not sure why people say that. I might have to poke around a little and see what's going on at the ryokan here. So we're in Misawa. Didn't we call someone... Weren't they at some convention? Hi Nancy, what's up? How's the expo How's the going? expo going, George? It's crazy. I've never seen so many clever people in one space. I'm definitely dealing with a little bit of that small fish, large pond anxiety. I'm still trying to get tickets for you, but it's not looking good. Hmm. That's okay. Thanks for trying. Okay. I'll let so, you go. Bye. I guess we can't meet up with them. Okay. 
Zero messages. <laughs> what? Classic. Silhouette. Classic. Purple. Make it purple. <laughs> yes. <laughs> this is the best. Okay, exit phone, please. Um, so I have no idea what to do. Should we observations better not forget the stations from the guide in my room the ryokan is at misawa station pachinko parlor is at kurei station maybe we should go there exposition center is at matsue station oh miyako's grandmother gives lessons in room 18 strange robotic cat i'm staying at 24 i'm off to japan to teach an explorer okay oh so it's like this is the oldest stuff and the higher we scroll up the the newer stuff is. Okay, so... Uh, we came from Misawa. Pachinko parlor is in Kure. <laughs> She's been training for three months. Okay. Hey! We did it! We got somewhere. This looks cool. Bento. But no one's here. Bento boxes. God, they must have had such a fun time going traveling Japan for their game. The virtual nyao? Yeah, nyao. Ba charu nyao. Lifelike movement, real cat noises. Teach your cat to sit, stay, guard, meow, groom, and more. Allergy free. Oh no! Ooh. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay. No ticket, no entry. No, oh, no tickets yet. No ticket, no entry. So I guess, I guess this is it. We can't do anything else here. Can't like go to the back either. Train station. Chikate, Chikate no eki. <laughs> it says uh, subway station. Without actually saying the name of the station. Um, can we go down the stairs? No. Okay, let's go back. Uh, where was the gambling? Kure station. This is very confusing. So you want to do some gambling? That Yurei comic looks interesting. I should check it out. Yurei comic? Which one? I don't see it. Do we need some coin? Why is this so accurate? Printo Tada? Free prints? Can we go in? Ugh, creepy. I don't think I need to keep this one. <laughs> okay. Well, that was that. I need a card to play this game. Do wait, we have a card. We have a train card. I need to I need to find a card first before I can play Pachinko. Okay. Do you think we can find a card somewhere? So we need to win money for this?
Can we get a card here? I'd like to see what the comic has to say about hauntings. I don't know where she's looking at. Oh. I think this is for later. Oh, now we're back. Okay. Well, we tried. <laughs> you have to earn the card later. Yeah. Should we go back? Should we go back to the Ryokan? Ah, we're back. So what do we do? Hi. I'll stop bugging you now. Okay, see ya. <laughs> see ya. Have you talked to Dentaro the bats? No. I saw the bath somewhere though, but it was like men's only, so I didn't go in. I think it was here somewhere? Oh my god, how did I remember? Whoa, hang on! Men only right now. Yeah, so... What do you mean? Oh, he's the probably baths. gonna say it. The blue banner means the baths are for men. The red banner means women only. I don't know why we don't mention this at the front desk. This is useful information. So anyway, I'm Rentaro. I'm out in the garden if you need anything. Um, Jokan's. Oh. oh, oops. Ow, that hurt. <laughs> Jokan's usually have one like bath area, which is like the nice onsen stuff. Um, so because it's like such a nice luxurious area, they usually only have one. So they switch the banners on the entrance to indicate whether it's time for men only to go take a bath or women only to take a bath. So right now it's men only. So women can't take a bath at it this time. Is he around here? I don't see him. Where is he? He said he was out in the garden, right? Oh, is he in this little house? <laughs> He's Hi again. A little shed. I'm Rentaro. <laughs> it's nice to meet you, officially. So, um, you're still here. That's surprising. I'm Nancy. What do you mean, surprising? Did I say that? Whoops. <laughs> so, you're American. From New York City? No, a place called River Heights. It's in... Oh, okay. That's one of the places I always wanted to go. I mean, you'd have to be crazy to live there. But on the other hand, you'd have to be crazy not to live there. It's one of those, um, uh, unwinnables. Do you work here? Technically, it's a complicated thing we've got going on. I'm sort of like the handyman around here. So... Should I bother getting to know you, or are you going to be like all of the rest? I don't know. What do all of the rest do? Get spooked in the middle of the night? Pack their bags and never come back? <gasps> Even the ones who come to see the ghosts? <gasps> I shouldn't be telling you this. Oh well, already did. If you see Takaido, this conversation never happened. Ghosts? What ghosts? We got one of those, um... Haunted hotspot guides. <laughs> so we get a lot of ghost hunters here. And that's always a treat because they're totally not obnoxious. <laughs> so people think this place is haunted? Well, some people think this place is haunted. Kind of like some people think the moon landing was faked. And some people like adult contemporary. Don't be one of those people. <laughs> you like puzzles? <laughs> I guess you could say that. I figured I do. you're going to love this. It's called a nanogram. Ooh, what's that? It's just another example yes. of how awesome numbers are. Letters are cool <laughs> yes, all, yes, yes, they yes. just make words. I mean, get with the game, letters. Numbers, on the other hand, get a few handfuls of those and you can make a bridge or send a person into space or express the makeup of our genetic code or, or they can make a neat picture. Okay. Take a look in here. All you need to do is look this over and finish the pattern. Yes. And when you're done, picture! Here, take this. Give it a shot. 
Bring it back when you're done, and I'll give you something oh, better. Oh, let's do it. Sure. Dude, let's do and there it. Are instructions inside in case you get stuck. I don't want to talk to him now. I want to do the puzzle. Can you tell me anything about Takai? Can you Takai? tell me anything about Takai? Takai? She can be a little Takai. tough, but she's really wonderful. She works herself way too hard, though. I wish I could get her to just relax a little. But you can't tell her to do anything unless you want a lecture back in return. Yeah, my. I take it you've been lectured by Takai before. I pretty much grew up here. I did. Believe it or not, I was not always the saint you see standing before you. So, I've been on the sad end of a lecture or two. But I've <sighs> overheard more. Always <laughs> hilarious when they're not directed at you. I did help Seno with that puzzle, yeah, so I'm excited to do it. <laughs> Miroko seems to really like Suki. What are you building there? Do you know where I can get a card for the pachinko parlor? Do you know where I can get a card for the pachinko parlor? It seems like I'm always running into those things. Guests need them everywhere. Take a look around. I'm sure you'll find one. Oh, shit. Miwako seems to really like Suki. I know, which is great, because that girl is hard to buy for. Hmm. And it's been sort of a gift-heavy year. Either she's getting crazy sensitive or I'm becoming a huge jerk. Hmm. Hard to say. <laughs> it's definitely one or both of those things. I wonder what Sean's going to get me for my birthday. I, I told him a couple things that I would like, but he keeps saying it's not good enough, so I don't know. Um, I asked for a badminton set so we can tr we can play badminton together. What are you building there? Oh, this! This is the Rentaro 4000! I saw that got inspired by Suki. <laughs> What's it going to be? <laughs> a robotic dog! Or maybe just oh, a doggo. robotic dog's leg. <laughs> I'll be honest, I had no idea how wrong these things take to build. <laughs> But then again, He's funny. a dog's leg is not a good gift without the rest of the dog. Sort of borders on creepy, come to think of it. Is it going to be a gift for Miwako? Oh, definitely. She's my robotic muse. <laughs> but she's not robotic. <laughs> not that you'd think she is. <sighs> and this is why I work with machines. They're totally oblivious to awkwardness. The writing is really good in this game. Like, I'm really impressed. I'll let you go. Bye! Oh, yes! This is my shit! Okay. Can I just hold it? Oh, nice. Okay. So if this is an 8, that means it's at least these. Whether it's on this side or this side, I don't know. The music is creepy! The fuck is going on? The music is breaking. It's really creepy. Okay, this is four already, so that one's done. So nothing can go here. This is supposed to be eight, though. So it's probably like that, then. And then this is four, and this is two. So then we get... Oh, it's a heart! Oh. I did it! Yeah. Is there more? Is there only one? Is that it? Do I need to do... Oh. I can only do one nonogram? No! That's it? I think so. Hi! I finished, I finished the nonograms the puzzle. puzzle. Awesome! Nice job! I loved it! What do you think? I Fucking loved it. love it. I've got something better. You know it, you love it. The original! Sudoku! Give it to me. Oh, I've played that before. Great! Great! I've got some good ones for you here. Here you go. Bring it back if you want more. Oh, fuck yeah. Let's do it. I'm back for more nanograms. Here you go. Oh, nice. So we get multiple ones? I'll let you get back to work. Peace out. Peace out. Ooh. 
Ooh, yes. Okay. One, 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 three, three, one, one, one. Okay. So that's one, two, one, one. One, two, one, one. Another one down. We did it. I don't see what it is. Oh, is this the head of the snail then? If this is like the house? I think I did it. <laughs> yeah, the creepy tunes, right? Okay. Ah, uh, Sudoku. Nice. Oh, it's been so long since I've done one of these. The music is making me nervous. It has no right to make me nervous for a game of Sudoku. <laughs> uh, this is a seven. Eight. I did it! Whew. Okay, looks like that's it. We don't have renograms, so should we go back to him again? Hello. I'm back for more nanograms. <laughs> Here you go. You can always start solving the Sudoku in the train station. What does that mean? Am I not supposed to do it right now? I finished up the Sudoku. Way to go. So, what do you think? Oh, for the happier music. Oh. <laughs> uh it's Okay. It's not really my thing. Hmm. I'll have to keep an eye on you, Nancy. <laughs> You're trying to get me all wound up. Not a big fan. I've got one last type of puzzle to show you. This is one of my favorites. Renograms. Renograms. It's all about creating an unbroken string of numbers. Tell me what you think when you're done. Here you go. I don't know if I know that type of puzzle. Can I have another Sudoku puzzle? Here you go. If you don't solve it right, the ghost gets I you. I should go. <laughs> I'll talk to you later. Bye. Oh, whoops. So what is a renogram? Fill the grid with available numbers to create a single consecutive string from 1 to 56, with each number connecting to the next along the hori horizontal, vertical, or diagonal. Okay. Whoa. What are these? Oh, I have to fill it in. Wait, there's that many spaces? Wait, so four is here, so we need to make a line to that. And seven is there. Oh my god. I've never played this before. Five, six, seven. Eight. 11 is there, so 9, 10, 12, 13, 15, 16, 17, 18, 21 is there. Oh, we can't do 25. So that means this has to be. 25. Oh, this is interesting. Okay, so... 29... That Now it still works, right? 18, 19, 20, yeah. 21, 22, 23, 5, 6, 7, 8. This is like that little footstep puzzle that we did. 33 is up there, so... 30, 31... 32, 33, 34, 35, 6, 7, 8, 39, 40, 41, 
two, three. I'm assuming it all has to be filled up, right? Five, six, seven, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 45, 56. I did it! That's awesome! I didn't know this existed. Oh, hell yes! Oh my god, it's getting harder now. So this is 15. Yeah. Then 1, 5, 2, 2. 8 and 2. Okay. This is 9, okay. 1, 2, 3. We still need a fourth one. So 4, 8, 9. And 1. Which means this is a 3. There, there. 2. One, five, two. No puzzle stands a chance. It's a frog! <laughs> Did it! Oh my god, my brain. <laughs> I love these puzzles though. Sudoku, I'm not a huge fan. I've just played it too much. Uh, when I was younger. They kind of grew old after a time, you know. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six as well. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six as well. Damn. Um, and then we're gonna end here. Another one down. Nothing Nancy Drew can't do. Is there more? No, I did it. Hi. I finished up the Renegrams puzzle. <gasps> Great. Dude, I did it. I knew you would. <laughs> Back for Don't more. Tell the other puzzles, <laughs> but this is my favorite. I'm back for more nanograms. Here you go. <laughs> Thanks. Can I have another so, Sudoku puzzle? Is this go. like endless? Bring it back if you want more. <laughs> or does it finish at some point? I'm ready for more renograms. Can we just do Here this for go. like 20 hours or <laughs> There's three levels in each. Okay. I should go. I'll talk to you later. Peace out. Peace out. So we're finishing I'm finishing them up now. Oh, there's a fourth one though. Is this the last one? Can we have a stream just with Stoku nanograms and that those kind of puzzles? I mean I, w I wouldn't be against it. I'm on senior detective. Oh okay, but there is an is an end to it probably. Okay, it's fifteen again. There, with a little room for variation. This one's done. Yep. Um, one, three, one. So that has to be that. Okay. My brain is about to explode. One, three, two, two. Two, five, two. Oh, look at that. Two, one. One, two. So that one's done. One, one, two. Take that puzzle. You're Jeez, solved. You scared me. <laughs> it's a magnifying glass with a question mark in it. Wait, so there's eight. Okay, maybe I want to do one more of these, and then maybe we should just do a couple each. Nancy Drew stream. Okay. Oh, there's the four. Oh, maybe put 11 there and then put 12 here and 2 there. Does that work? One. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Okay, so 50, 51, 52, 53. Another one down. <laughs> fun! So fun! 
I think I did it. Yeah, that's it. Hi. Okay, I let's, finished um, another Renegrams puzzle. Here you go. Let's just grab one more for next time. I'm back for more nanograms. I want to do them so go. bad, but we need to get some game done. <laughs> I should go. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye. Peace out. Um, does anyone know? Oh, God, I really regret not having this. <laughs> As a senior detective, I don't need a task list. Uh, yeah, What's let's go. What's going on? I should listen in. Oh. The strange sounds on the pounding, on the screaming at all hours of the night, waking up my family, scaring the children. <laughs> that German to... accent. If you ask me, this real candidate to be closed down immediately. Um, very sorry. Sorry changes nothing. This is unacceptable. I want my money back, and I want a car sent immediately to take us anywhere else. Damn. I love how nosy Nancy Drew is. Oh, hello, Nancy son. That guest seemed pretty upset. Oh, it's nothing to worry about. Trust me, I see a lot at this desk, and one thing never changes travel is disorienting. It's so very easy to get upset when you're far from home. That's why we try to make things as comfortable as possible. What's been what scaring, has been the, scaring guests? the guests away? Oh, nothing. They're not scared. It's something else. Can I help you with anything? I met Rentaro. Rentaro. Oh, uh, Rentaro? He's my Rentaro. boyfriend. He's <sighs> also handyman around here. Have you two been dating long? Because she's sorry. so nosy. I should really get back to my paperwork. But if you have any questions about the Dokan, please don't hesitate to ask. I should go. I should go. I'll talk to you later. Okay, see ya. I would feel so like, oh, the guest list is significantly shorter. <laughs> People have been leaving. I would feel so intruded upon if, um, <laughs> if, if I would be working somewhere, like just behind a counter somewhere and someone came up to me and be like, so that dude that works here, is he your boyfriend? How long have you guys been together? I'd be like, none of your fucking business. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my bed's been made. Nice. Okay, so you guys said we need to set an alarm. For class. Um, cat has no neck or body. <laughs> 1 a.m.? Oh, but it's... It's 12.30 already. So we can... So after 1 a.m. we can explore the front desk. Oh! If you set an alarm it just skips you to that time. Oh, I see. Um, how do I... Oh, no, wait. I thought I was in the hallway already. Nice. Let's go snoop! <gasps> oh! <laughs> hey, Suki, kitty. who's a good girl? Stand! Suki, tate! tate. <laughs> so creepy! <laughs> and even the desktop Looks background! Like I'll need a password! Oh god, what is it? It's long. Do we have to type Japanese? So we do sukitate. Okay, um how do I back out of this? The Belvarian Alps, Greece, Dread Isles. Ooh. He doesn't like me getting in there. Hmm. Is there any way to find out the password? This cat will go straight for your soul. <laughs> nice kitty. Dentaro? Maybe. I wonder if Miwako hid the password somewhere around here. Oh, it's it should be hidden around here? 
Who's my favorite robotic cat? Maybe if I have Suki? make him stand. Kate. I can search. No, I can't. Okay. I was hoping to keep him busy, but... <laughs> Turn off the cat. Yeah. You'll find the password later. Yeah, I don't think I... Unless it's something of this, but... I, sh I think it should be more obvious if it's like a Japanese password. Um, so I guess that's it for now. What's this? Oh. What? Are you missing a card? Suki self-destruct, yeah. Oh. I'm missing a red one, I think. Right? There's a key in the cabinet. How do I back out of this? I don't know how to exit this. Crawl Meister card 3000. Having difficulty remembering all those numbers, security codes, worry no more. Introducing the Crawl Meister 3000, the latest in state of the art key card security systems. Our system uses an 8x8 grid with a unique colored entry code designed by the user. Color are then split and encoded onto five cards. Yeah, we only have four. Extra squares on each card for added security. To open the secure compartment, place the key cards into their slots. Yeah, okay. So we need another one for that. I thought that was something. 7 p.m. So we're just skipping a whole day. So like you can't do the teaching. Oh. <gasps> what? <gasps> what was that? Can we follow it? Go look. Oh Jesus. no, the screen tour. I better tell Mawako about this tomorrow. It must have just been my It was on the balcony. I should try to get some more sleep. Cool. Okay. So we taught at school. Now we're back in the hotel. <laughs> Forgot I set my alarm to this. <laughs> we should tell Miwako about breaking the screen door. The clumsy foreigners that we are. Hello. Oh, hi, Nancy. What was the name of the place you're staying at again? The Ryokan Hie. Told you. Guess you're right. What are you two talking about? We met this girl at a bento booth at the expo. And she grew up at the Ryokan you're staying at. Mm. Pretty crazy coincidence. Is her name Yumi? That's the one. You've got to get down here and meet her. She's so much fun. She told us all about everyone at the Ryokan, and it sounds like you've got your hands full. I should come to meet her. I have a few questions. Uh-oh. Uh-oh what? I know that tone of voice. What tone of voice? <laughs> they know yep, me so that's well. the one. <laughs> what are you talking about? You're working a case, aren't you? <laughs> Maybe. I don't know exactly what is going on at the Ryokan, but it's really strange. Busted. Busted. Okay, you got me. I may Bam, have found cinnamon. a mystery. <laughs> Boom. Shocking. So, what can we do for you? Yeah, what's going on? Well, I saw something really strange in my room. What? A shadowy figure showed up in my room. But when I looked out on the balcony, no one was there. It was like whoever it was just disappeared. Creepy. Okay, that's it. We're leaving Japan. <laughs> I'm sure there is a logical explanation. Me too. I'm just not sure what it is yet. The two of you, I swear, if we were being chased by a dinosaur, you two would be too busy debating about the fossil record to run away. 
Why did you have to panic? <laughs> it was pretty scary, I admit. But I don't believe that someone could just disappear. Right. Well, you said a shadow figure, right? Maybe it was some sort of trick of the light. That's what I was thinking. I'll keep an eye out for something like that. Spooky. Anything else? Have you seen the robotic cats they have here? I love those! I don't know if they're cute or creepy, but I love them anyway. Miwako has one. It's cute, but it's a little aggressive. <laughs> it's in guard mode. There's a way to override that, some sort of code word. Ooh. Right. I need to figure out what it is. Hmm. I bet if I check around the expo, I can find someone who knows. Yeah, didn't we find that the... That would be amazing. Thanks. Anytime. Need we went to else? the expo. And I'll we talk saw to you the... later. Bye. We saw the cat stand, so... Okay, let's tell Miwako about the screen door we broke, and then we'll go to the expo to talk to Yumi. Hello. I tore one of the screens in my room. I'm really sorry. You're in deep shit Do now. Do not worry, Nancy-san. This happens often. Very easy to fix, just a little steam to loosen the glue. I'll have Lentalo take care of it immediately. Great, yes. thanks. When I tore the screen, I think I saw someone on my balcony. Right. It's nothing to worry about. The screens really distort things sometimes. I'm sure it was just your imagination. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. I'm sure of it. There's nothing to worry about. I'll let you get back to work. <laughs> Maybe it later. was my imagination. Just saw a figure distinctly looking like a person, but, you know. Maybe. There was a shortcut from Misa. Oh, I didn't see that. Well, now I'm here. Thank you, Giggles. So, there was someone at the bento thing? Hi, is your name Yumi? Absolutely not. Who's asking? It might be. Are you going to order? What's your agenda here, stranger? <laughs> I'm Nancy Drew. Uh, nope, never heard of you, but thank you for saying your name out loud. Oh, wait, Nancy Drew? As in friends with Beth and George and staying at the Ryokin, Nancy Drew? Or are there two oh my of you? God. Which one is it? That's me, the friends with Bess and George. This is brilliant dialogue. Excellent. Yes, perfect. Get over here. Come on. You're learning to make bento the Yumi way. Come on, trust me, it's a life skill. Once you know how to make a good bento box, you pretty much got the whole world all figured out. Okay. Sure, sounds sure, good. Sure, sounds good. Fantastic! Cody, here thanks for the 46 ingredients. months. You may notice that they run the gamut from pretty cute to insanely adorable. <laughs> this is not an accident. Okay, very easy. The customers will give you a list of what they want and how they want it organized, and you pack it together. You won't believe how easy it is. Okay, I gotta go. Going? Where what? are you going? She's leaving the me? Store. Good luck. You'll do fine. I'll be back soon. <laughs> She's Wait. leaving. Wait. I guess I'd better get to work. Uh, how? Okay. Well, I don't know what this is. Oh, this is egg. This is rice. Egg rice sandwich. Oh, so this must be sandwich. So it must be cat sandwich. Pig sandwich. Pig egg. I don't know what these are though. And then we have pig and cat. I guess that's not it. I hated this puzzle. Yeah, I'm trying to I'm trying to figure out what this is. Are these like conditions? Like it's cat, rice, and bear. So that means cat rice must be here. And then bear is here. Yeah, and there's three left. Okay, so I guess I need to fill them all. And then we have piggy should be surrounded by egg and rice. So I guess this... Well, okay, these three have a condition, like it needs to be sandwich, sandwich, egg. So that's the only way we can do that. And these three are 
below each other, so that can only be here. So I think this is correct. But this one can be different. I, I forgot what this is. Oh, it's rice. Okay. So we want something egg down here. Oh, no, wait. It has to be pig. So it should be pig egg. Where did I put that one? Oh, here. Oh, yeah. I oh, said so that doesn't work. So this must be rice and egg. Okay. Hey, I did it! I did it! It was pretty cute. Thanks for helping out, Nancy. Okay, I figured it out. Could you tell me a little bit about the Ryukon? I'm not into that sort Ryukon? of thing. Couldn't you find a pamphlet? I was hoping for an insider's opinion. Oh, I get it. You want the dirt on the situation, right? Yes, exactly. Interesting. You're working some kind of anger here, aren't you? Not that it matters. Still way too busy to talk. I know you're busy, but I, need but a bento I for helped you. you out with yeah. bento. And all I want is a little information. Okay. Surrounded okay. by breathtaking views you'll not soon forget, the Ryoka Hie opens the door to a simpler time. Perfect for the business traveler hoping to experience traditional Japan, or the family in search of that perfect vacation. Ryokin Hie, discover Japan, discover you. <sighs> That's I wish I could travel again. but not exactly what I wanted to I know. Go, I want to go it? to a Ryokan. That's mine from years back. I was thinking of going into advertising, but then I thought, nah. I was hoping you could <laughs> tell me a little about some of the strange things that have been happening. Aha! If you really want to know. Oh no! I'm running out of bento boxes! Can you please go grab my backup stock from my apartment? This is the sort of thing that can move us from buddies to straight up besties. Damn. Sure. Sure. Great. It's just over by the Kurume station. I could tell right away that we were going to be friends. Here's my key. Damn. I would not oh, give my key. Yes. My number is 075-021-5855. I would love a bento like that. I would not give my key to someone I just met. <laughs> just asking questions. Uh, your grandma seems hasn't talked to me. What do you think of Nentoro? I, I guess we can do all these questions. Your grandmother anyway. seems a little hesitant to talk to me. That's the shocker of the decade. She's hesitant to talk to herself. <laughs> what do you think of Rentaro? Other than that he should get a job at the nerd statue factory as their primary model? He's a good time. <laughs> what do you think of Rentaro? He seems nice. He seems nice. Nice puzzles. He's a bit of a pest. Nice works if you want to be polite, but come on. This isn't the Ryokan. You can say what you mean. That, that is, is what, what I, meant. I meant. Okay, if you say so. Uh, I Miyoko. met your sister, Miwako. You two seem pretty close. That doesn't sound like the impression you'd get by having a chat with Miwako. What are you trying to ask? Miwako seemed a little upset about the Ryokan. Do you know anything about that? That's more her area of expertise. I've never been the go-to girl for the Ryoka. That place the, 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 is the definition the, 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 the of the Ryoka. Guests come in, guests come out. It's brain-breakingly tedious. I don't know how Miwako puts up with it. These accents that they're trying to do are so weird. Uh, does Miwako like working at the Ryokan? Does Miwako like working at the Ryokan? What a yeah! Why what else yeah? would she be there day in and day out? <laughs> what that girl needs is to spend some time out here. A few weeks with me and my friends would be enough to shake her up and get her to have some fun for once. One sec. Oh, that background jingle. I think my chat may be froze again. I'm still live, aren't I? So I'm, I'm loading my desktop to see if I have chat there. Because I think... Okay, there we go. Because my... Remember last time I stream labs just kind of like... Was like, nah. I, your life, but let's not update chat anymore. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Um, so you don't want to take over? So you don't want to take over the Ryokan? Not even for a second. I mean, I don't even get the whole tradition thing. You want to go to the past? Get a time machine. I'm not one for living in the past. Have you ever read a history book? The past is where we keep all of the terrible things that have happened. <laughs> this girl, holy shit. Can you tell me a little bit about what happened with your mother? This is not the time or the place. Is there a better time? Maybe when you're not at work? <sighs> there 
there's never going to be a time or place. Just drop it. Wait, that's it? Can you it? come back in a bit? Hmm, okay. So she wants us to get her... Kurume Station. Because for some reason she keeps her store stuck just at home. So I guess we're gonna leave. We wanna check out the cat? There's no commands here at least. Okay. I guess we gotta go to the station. Um, Kurume. Kurume. Hello? Hello? Andy, good news! We met Ryuichi, the creator of the Suki cats. Ryuichi. Is, he won't give away the secret <laughs> phrases Ryuichi. unless you buy one of the cats. All right, thanks for trying. But then the guy told George, for such a captivating, beautiful, gorgeous girl, he'd be willing to make an exception. Uh, sexist? You're turning red. Nancy, she's turning red! Am not! Anyway, there's a catch. He only shares secrets with the like-minded. He gave me this monster puzzle to solve, but I'm too busy with expo stuff to solve it right now. Any chance that you could take a look at it? Yes. Sure. <laughs> Anything for such a captivating, beautiful. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> I'll send it right over to you at the Ryokan. How's Kyoto? How's Kyoto? It's the best. Yumi's been showing me some of the coolest parts of town. The fashion here is crazy. Yumi took me to a store. I don't even know how to describe this place. Oh my god. It was oh my god. pink. Really, really pink. It had the pink version of everything you could imagine. This is a huge surprised. spider crawling Neither in the hallway. I, but I was a little horrified. But then she took us to see the Gion district. So cool. Ooh, she was oh, it's so big. At least plays, it's walking in the other direction. Anyway. I'm going to close my door. Sean will be like, what the fuck? She never closes her door. What's going on? <laughs> okay. I'll let you get back to work. Talk to you later. So we get a puzzle at the Ryogan. Cool. Oh, this is a very Japanese house. Wow. So, bento boxes? These must be what Yumi was talking about. Cool. Do you want to do some snooping? Unveiling, unveiling, unveiling ghosts or unveiling, unveiling. Paranormal investigations from around the world. Savannah Woodham. To the Shimizu family, your hospitality during this difficult time has been Im immeasurable. Thank you for allowing me into your homes and your lives. If you ever find yourself in the state of Georgia, you've got a place to stay. Okay. Scariest thing is you'll never see it again. I know, right? It's just gonna be somewhere in the house right now. Savannah Woodham. That's oh, the author number. of this book. I should hang on to this. Having her phone number might come in handy. Nice. It looks like someone tore <gasps> out one of the chapters. Oh. Well, oh, I'm trying to... Chapter... The Ryokan Hie is missing. Well, fuck. I feel... Oh, God. Choose shape, locate colors, click to enter? Excuse me? I need some kind of hint for this, I think. Is that an Xbox? <laughs> Make your own shadow puppets. <gasps> That's what that was! In front of the... on the balcony! It was a shadow puppet. Going in front of the window. She has something to do with it. Shadow puppets have been entertaining audiences for millennia. Only a light source 2D cutout puppet and a screen on which to project the shadow. Screen door! Puppeteer brings to life a whole stories told in silhouette. Performance art is believed to have originated in China during the Han Dynasty to console the emperor who had recently lost a beloved lady. Ah, 
While traditional shadow puppets were made of leather with rods of wood and bone, or bone, you can make your own puppets with more basic materials. Mm-hmm. 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 Um... That. Dear Marianne, as usual, these letters are piling up and I haven't made it to the post office. It was great seeing you during your visit. Hurry back soon. I know I promised to make my way over to the States, but life always has other plans. The girls are keeping me busy and the Ryokan is double booked as usual. Yumi wanted me to tell you that she had a nice time during your visit, although it would be hard to tell with her pouting for the cheap seats the whole time. She and Miwako have been at each other's throats lately. It's ugly. I hope it's a face, but I'm beginning to worry that it might not be. Um, Cassie and Ben are such good friends, I wish I knew your secret. They're so different, you know. They remind me of you and me when we were kids. You were always so serious and I was always doing my best to get you in trouble. I think that's what made us such good friends. But for the two of them, it's always a battle. Enough of that. Send my love to the family and I can't wait to see you again. So, so, Kasumi. Hmm. So... Excuse me? Oh, this is uh, Japanese numerals, basically. We need a passcode. Four numbers. I think that's everything we can do right now. Bathroom? Ooh. I need to translate that. Oh, well. You have a dictionary. Die. <laughs> die, die, die. Oh my. That's it? Oh, there's a disc there. Steal that. My god, Nancy Drew is so fucking nosy. You're just stealing shit. Girl just wanted her- she's like, I can trust you. Go get me some stuff in my apartment. Nancy Drew's like, uh-huh, I'll get you some stuff. Okay, I think that's it for now. Did I miss anything? You'll be able to choose Matsue when you're leaving her apartment. Okay, thank you. Nancy Drew is the worst person to give your house keys to, yeah. <laughs> Oodles of noodle! Thank you so much for the sub, thank you. Use the DVD. I'll do that. That's a good idea. Oh. Goes in there. Static on a computer. <laughs> Damn! That? That's slightly spooky! Okay. I still have it on me. Anything else you guys say I should do before I leave? Seven days left, yeah. <laughs> Oh, we can call Savannah? That's- that's right. Um... Let's see. Savannah Woodham's office, Logan speaking. Can I speak to Savannah Woodham, please? Are you one of our interviews? Interviews? I'm Savannah interviews. Woodham's assistant. Is she interviewing you about the expo? No, I actually want to speak to Savannah about a book she wrote. Oh, great! I'm so glad you called. Really? Why is that? It's been like three days since I've gotten to hang up on anyone. <laughs> I wonder if I'm still good at it. <laughs> oh my god, that's such a sassy comeback. Holy shit! Oh, I wish I had that amount of sass on the phone. Holy shit. Oh, I got a message? Yumi? <laughs> what the fuck? Who... who is this? Okay, let's go back. 
so where was that? Um, okay, it was at the expo, Matsue. There we go. That's much easier. Okay, I should pay more attention when I choose the station next time. Snowy Secret, thanks so much for the three months. Thank you. Once forward, turn right. There she is. Nancy! And you've got my boxes. Neat! Here, I've got a thing for you. What? It's a phone charm. You can't oh, not have one. Oh, cute! Thank you! Thanks. Arigato. What's it do? Come to Nothing. think of it, it you doesn't look at really it. do anything. Get a job, phone charm. It probably won't. That's okay, <laughs> just hang it on your phone. I've got tons. Help me with bento and I'll hook you up with some super cute ones. Mmm, that DVD I though. I watched that DVD at your place. It was very strange. You did what? Can you Shouldn't imagine? Have? Oh no, I'm sorry, Yumi. I'm sure it'll be fine. Just be very cautious. What do you mean? You have to be cautious about everything here, Nancy. Can you imagine giving your key to someone to pick up something from your place and then they come back and be like, by the way, I just sat down on your bed and watched the movie. <laughs> Snooped in your books, tried to access your computer. Your outfit is very interesting. Where did you get it? Get it? Oh, you cannot get something this cool in a store. I made it. Whoa. You make your own clothes? Oh, right. Yeah, I got you sick of the waiting for the boutiques stuff. to catch up to me. The places I go around here, fashion is the business. You don't show up looking out of date. Oh, I've got the best thing. You gotta have it. I use it to come up with all of my new ideas. Oh, what's that? It's a program for your phone. You upload pictures to the computer and send them to your phone. It lets you test out a new look on you or your friends. It's back at my place on the computer. Sounds great. I don't usually have time to keep up with the latest fashion trends. I could sort of tell, but I wasn't sure if you were going huh? for an irony thing with your outfit. Oh my god! Hey. <laughs> Just teasing. You pull off the old school thing Nancy drew. Confused Some things don't cheek, go out okay. of style. If you help me out with a little more bento right now, I'll hook you up with the program. Come on. Sure, let's do it. Okay, this one's a lot more complicated. Damn. Okay, how are these gonna fit together? Holy shit. Okay, so this has to be in the middle. Okay, let's start there. Later. So then it's still the bears on top of each other. Yeah, got it? Okay, thanks. And then we just have to put the pig here, here, whatever works. Okay, so let me write this down. <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> This is such a 2020 solution to an old puzzle. Okay, so middle, bear egg. That was actually right! Bear sandwich, and then bear rice is the only one left. Okay. Then we have bunny sandwich here, pig rice here. Okay, and the rest... How do we overlay them? Fuck. Um, so we still have four spots for these. Oh yeah, we wanted two pigs. And this needs to be a sandwich. Sandwich, rice, egg. So it's gonna be one of these. Do we have any other requirement? Bottom right, pig, egg. Okay, so then this has to be sandwich, yeah. Then we have two bunnies left. All right, another order down. Great job. Here you go, Nancy. That's a crazy ass puzzle. Oh, thank you. Ready to help with more bento. <laughs> Am I though? I don't think I'm mentally ready for that. <laughs> Why do you have a book on shadow puppets? Oh, that's Miwako's. Shouldn't be in my apartment. It's just a stupid book about puppets. It's just another one of the things that my grandmother is trying to always push on us. Always. Could you use something like this to make spooky shadows from far away? Say a balcony? Yeah, I guess. That's Miwako's. Hmm. Love that last picture of you and Bess. 
I know, isn't that one great? She's not like, how'd you find that? Would you like a phone charm? This one's not so pretty, but since it's from you, I like it. This is, isn't that the one she gave me? What does Takai think of you working here? It's a phase. Otto snap out of it. Like I've been hypnotized and one day someone says the right word and snaps their fingers and Otto go. Hero, I am Yumi. One job running Ryokan, please. She's old school like that. Thinks the fun parts of life are a phase. And the nasty parts are the bees and knees. Bees and knees. I don't understand. If you're the one who's supposed to take over the Ryokan, why is Miwako the one working there? Ugh, Nancy-chan. Don't get all everyone else on me here. If I had known I was supposed to run that place when I grew up, I would have taken a pass on the whole firstborn thing. Trust me. If Miwako left the Ryokan, who would run it? I don't know. It doesn't matter. Why do you care so much about it anyway? I'm Damn. just sort of naturally curious. I'd back burner that curiosity as long as you're staying at the Ryokan if I were you. What do you mean? Try not to find out, okay, Nancy? You seem nice. Damn. Do we have What's to do the on? bento, or is that, um... Okay, we we said all of these. Do we have to do the other puzzle, or is it more just bonus we'll content? Talk to you later. For now. Peace out, Nancy Drew. Oh, maybe, maybe they're like solutions, yeah. Let's check my thing. Found a book, yeah. It's been torn out, Yumi's apartment is... Okay, so this is nothing really new. Yumi seems very concerned about the hauntings at the Ryokan, or is she just trying to scare me herself? She runs a bento stand. Yumi has a book about shadow puppets she claims isn't hers. Pretty suspicious considering the spooky shadows I've seen. Yeah. Um, oh, we have the password for her place. Let's do that. Snoop around at her place. Was it Kurume? Okay, there we go. Much easier. <laughs> oh. Message. The fuck? What a weird picture. Um, computer. So, we need this. Can I have it on the side as I do this puzzle? I think hidden object games have spoiled me. Because they put, like, if you find a thing, they just put it next to you. Okay, so... I took a picture of it with my phone. It's this shape. Oh god, and we need to... Oh god. Okay, look for yellow and purple above each other. Twelve down. Like that. Oh! That's it! Holy shit. <laughs> Choose a model. My god, what are we doing? Oh, that's cute. <laughs> what am I doing? God, I'm making- oh god, I made the Sword Art Online girl. What's her face? I don't like any of this. Sure. Done. Sugo <laughs> yatta! Awesome, you did it! So. Enter a phone number? Who do we send it to? Does it matter? Do we have to send it to ourselves?
back. Anyone is fine. Send it to Yumi then. Or do I have to write this down? So I can... Oh, got him. Type it in. Okay. Hey, Fruits! 54 months! Thank you so much. Thank you. Um, so I sent one. Is that what we were supposed to do? Way to make a style in the avatar. Phone fashion software is here to keep your whole contact list looking fashionably fly. See you on the runway. Did I do it? Well, no new clues. Um, we don't have the thing in our inventory anymore, at least. Check your contacts. Nancy? Send it to myself? Check Yumi's picture in the phone. Oh, I can make pictures for everyone? It's a puzzle for later. Oh, okay, so we're good for now then. Um, what else should we do? We still have some puzzles. We tried calling this number. This makes me think of Shannon Woodward. <laughs> the voice actress for Dina. <laughs> Savannah Woodham. Shannon Woodward. We could go to the baths. Are you good for now? Okay. Let's go back to the Yokan then. I feel weird being in someone else's place anyway. Misawa. Gotta call Bess and George. Gotcha. Thanks, guys. Hi, Nancy. What's up? Found a strange book about ghosts with a note from the author. I found a strange book about ghosts in Yumi's apartment with a note from the author. What do you mean? It had a dedication from the author, Savannah Woodham, to the Shimizu family. But the really Shimizu. weird thing is, there's a chapter missing. What was in the missing chapter? Uh, nope, strike that. That is a dumb question. That's pretty strange. Maybe you can find another copy of the book somewhere. There's a business card with the author's number inside. But more importantly, the table of contents says the missing chapter was about the Ryukon. Weird. Did you call? I called Savannah, but she's got a really protective assistant. <laughs> yeah? Apparently, she's in Kyoto now, covering the expo for some tech magazine. Oh, shit. So she's pretty busy. If I could get past her assistant, I could finally figure out what this whole book is about. Wait, so this guy is at the expo? Pretty sure. Then we've got this one. We do? <laughs> yep. We're going to find them, and you're going to flirt up a distraction. Their voice I acting am? is so good. Yes, you are. Well, at the very least, this will be interesting. And if it's a mortifying failure or anything, which it might be. We do live thousands of miles away. Solid point. We'll keep you updated. What do you guys think of what Yumi? What do you guys think of Yumi? She's so much fun. A little pushy sometimes, but I feel like I've known her for years and we've just met. She seems to really dislike the Ryukon. Do you think she'd want to see it closed down? Well, I can't say for sure. She does really seem to resent that place, but I'm not sure if she'd go as far as trying to get it shut down. I don't mm, know. Seems more like she just doesn't care. I'll talk to you later. Talk to you later. I should try and save. Okay. Because I hadn't even saved yet all of our progress from today. <laughs> um, so we just called Bess and George, right? I don't need to call them both now. 
I have a delivery for you. Oh Here. shit! <gasps> wow, Thanks. that's my name. It's not just my name, you know. It's it's my name. I have been writing it over and over until it became my name. Do you want to manage the Ryokan? Do you want to manage the Ryokan? Oh, BB wants right to come now in. I have to, but it's not that simple. Why not? It just isn't. It just isn't. Wow, that was a short conversation. BB. Did you see a big spider in the hallway? Did you eat him? <laughs> yeah, you just don't like being locked out of this room, do you? Can we talk to her again? Hi. Hi. From what I understand, the Ryokan has quite the reputation for being haunted. It is true that we have the reputation. Has that been difficult for business? It is nothing you need to concern yourself over. Yes, Can Nancy. you think of You're anyone so who would stand nosy. to gain if the Ryokan went out of business? No one I know. We all depend upon the Ryokan. Even Yumi and Lentaro. What about someone else on the outside? No. There's no one else. How does your grandmother feel about the Ryokan? I mean... It's her whole world. Yeah, she's she running it. She loves it more than anything or anyone she's ever met. What does she think of Yumi not working here? It's a very sore subject for her. And honestly, I've heard too much about it already. What do you mean? Every day I'm here, making sure all is well. It would just be nice to hear her at least mention all of the work I do. Just once. No. I'm sorry this is nothing you want to hear about. Do you think Yumi is ever going to come back here to run the Ryokan? If she knows what's good for her. She knows what's good for her. Why doesn't Yumi work here at the Ryokan? She's very... My mother used to call her a free spirit. Mm -hmm. But that's a nice way of saying that Yumi's selfish and doesn't want to help. You can't really Do blame you your kids Yumi for... get along? No. You can't really blame your kids for not wanting to take over your business, though. Your kids should be free to do whatever they want. I would hate it if my parents had some kind of business that was, like, completely not my interest. And they would just force it on you. They shouldn't feel like they should for it. They shouldn't feel like it's their birthright to force it on you. So I take it you're not very close. With us, the term isn't close. It's within striking range. <gasps> so we both try to avoid that. <laughs> Did Holy you shit. and Yumi ever get along? Of course, but really. She really... She was a very good big sister to have after... What happened with our mother? But soon enough, she was back to being the selfish, manipulated brat she is today. She's kind of a... She does seem a little demanding. She does seem yeah. a little <laughs> demanding. Not demanding. Manipulative and bratty. I wouldn't go that Trust far. Me, I've thought this one through. Okay. I'll let you get back to work. Bye. Bye. Um, Do you think we can talk to Grandma again? Oh, <laughs> I love that you can say your own sounds. Best ever. What? Best ever? What does that mean? Was it here? Oh, it's women's time. <gasps> I can finally wash myself. Oh, oh my god, this is exactly what it looks like. Holy shit. It's always like slightly awkward, I think, being Western and kind of... What's the word? It's prudish a word? Ugh, trying to think of the word where it's like you're kind of like not used to being naked around other people. Prudish, I think. Let's see. Prudish is a word. Okay. Let me see. What is it, what is it in Dutch? Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking of. Um, come, being raised where I was, I think I speak for most Western places. Like, you don't really... Especially with friends. You don't regularly get naked with friends, you know? Oh. That phone call. Um, Nancy, Operation Distract Logan is a go. Call Savannah. Gotta go. Oh shit, we need to call her now?
Hi, I'll finish my story later. I understand you do paranormal research. Can you help me with a case I'm working on? Sorry, I'm out of that business now. I'm working as a technology reporter. Unless you got a real hot tip about some emerging tech. <laughs> I don't really have the time today. What a great Bye accent. Now. Bye now. Call her again. You've reached Savannah Woodham. Aww. I'm not available at the moment. Please try again. Damn, that didn't work. Guess I can call them back now. Hi! Um... Not getting very I'm far I'm not getting Miko. very far with Miwako. What do you mean? She never seems to answer my questions directly. That's never a good sign. I'd keep an eye on her. She could just be quiet, or she could be hiding something. Hmm. <laughs> I'll okay. let you go. Bye. So that didn't quite work out, but uh, my story was like, we're not as I think most Western cultures aren't used to like bathing with friends, right? Or even family. Like I, I would not really get naked around my family. Um. Some family members I know don't give a shit and they just walk through the house naked. But if I know like anyone else is around in the house, I wouldn't do that. Um. Oh, hi. Is it almost food time? No. Two hours to go, Beep. You want to come cuddle instead? Um. So it was kind of awkward in the beginning for me to go like to places like this. Um. It is women's only, at least, so that's fine, of course. But to actually, like, so you walk into this room, you see those baskets and stuff? So this, you just undress here, and you put all your stuff, your clothes and stuff, in, in a basket, and then you go through those doors, and then you, like, wash yourself, and then you take a bath. You dip, you take a dip in a bath, and you basically just soak in it. So you have, like, a little shower area where you wash your hair and everything, and you wash yourself before you go in the bath. So the bath is really just to be soaking in. So it's it's a little bit awkward to like just walk around naked with strange strangers that you don't know. <laughs> and I've I've been to them as well with family. So I was like explaining like okay, clothes go there and then we go there naked and then we take a bath and everything. And it's fine, but it's always like slightly awkward, you know. It's always like because I wasn't raised like that. Part of me is always like <laughs> ooh. Look at that animation! <gasps> Holy shit! <gasps> Whoa! What the fuck? <gasps> Holy shit, that's creepy! What the fuck? <laughs> that was actually- she broke the whole fucking window as well. Oh my god, that's gonna be so expensive to fix. That was actually kind of creepy. <laughs> so good. Can we go in here? Yeah, oh look, this is exactly... Oh my god, it's so accurate. They must have actually been to Japan or something. Or spoken to someone who's been there. So this is like the shower area. So you sit down on like a stool and you just like wash yourself. And then you go into the nice bath. Ah, ah. Nice. And then you can rinse yourself with... Like, I normally take a cold shower, basically, after a bath, because I'm so hot. And then you leave, and then you just get dressed again. Um, and there's, like, a hair dryer, usually, so you can, like, dry your hair if you want to. Um, you usually get like towel and slippers and everything. Um, see this basket here? There was a basket on the left here. Oh, I'm getting a message. Uh, how do I how do I go back to it? Oh, the baskets? Nothing in it though. <laughs> why is she sending me this? Like, why would you send a random person that you just met that day? Oh. When on the search for ghosts, you want to make sure you don't call in any additional bad luck. 13 Japanese superstitions to be aware of. The number 4 is pronounced shi, the name the same as the word for death. That's true. Considered very unlucky. As a result, many hotels do not have a room number 4 or a fourth floor. Number 9 and the word pain also share pronunciation ku. Ah, oh, I don't know that one. Though not as unlucky as 4, 9 is still frequently skipped in numbering rooms. Not really. Maybe in hospitals, I don't know. I, I haven't been to hospitals often, but... 
Whistling at night will attract snakes. I do know there is a superstition against whistling when outside. Avoid sticking chopsticks upright in a bowl of rice. Yep, as this is traditionally part of the funeral ritual. So it's like, you don't leave your chopsticks if you're ever eating anywhere in a Japanese environment and you leave your chopsticks like sticking in the rice. Don't do that because they only do that for ghosts. It's basically so ghosts can eat the rice. Um, don't sleep with your head pointing north. Breaking a comb or a strap of your geta sandal will bring bad luck, I guess. Never write another person's name in red ink. Something bad will happen to them if you do. Oh, I like that. That's cool. Uh, this. This is uh, this is what I want to show you. This basket is probably where they drop off the towels that you've used. Um, so then at the end of the day, the staff can just empty that and wash those towels. Well, that was eventful. I think I'm about to round off the stream. But I wanted to talk to the grandma. Where is she at? Is she on this side? I forgot where her thingy is. I'm back in the main hall. Should we tell her that we saw Hello. something? The mirror I'm broke. I'm sorry. The mirror broke when I was in the baths. But before it broke, I saw the image of a woman who wasn't in the room with me. Don't worry, Nancy. I'm sure it was nothing. I have Lentalo take care of it right away. Until then, please stay away. I don't want you to get hurt. But I saw something. I'm sure of it. You work too hard, Nancy-san. Up too late, off to teach so early. You must rest more. Your judgment suffers if you I do not trust get her. enough rest. She's I too know nice. what I saw. Nancy-san, please. I have to ask you to let me get back to work. I don't trust her. She's... She doesn't seem to be too weirded out by me breaking all this shit. She's just like, oh, I'm sure it's nothing. It's fine. Oh, you broke something again? Oh, it's fine. Dentado can fix it. Um, did you, someone see a pachinko card? Did we pass one? Okay, I'm just gonna try and find... Okay, it's not here. Trying to find the granny's room. There. Ah, oh, it's closed now. Okay. Uh, maybe talk to Kentaro? Dentaro, I mean. Hello. Sorry. Do you believe that the Ryokan is haunted? Baskets I don't believe onsen? that anything oh, okay. is haunted. Ghosts uh, are just what happens when guilty people let their imaginations run wild. What do you mean? Think about it. Why do ghosts always want revenge? They're what people invent when they feel guilty. Hmm. If that wasn't the case, then ghosts would want all sorts of things. But no, they always want revenge. <laughs> so you grew up next door? My dad and I moved in when I was about seven. Why do you spend all of your time here when you live just next door? Never got my room decorated right. Plus, this place has always been more fun. And Miwako's here. And I've got my workshop. Is Suki supposed to be so protective? Took a swipe at you, huh? <laughs> Oh, that's one of her mods. Don't take it personally. It's actually really clever. There are these command words you say, and then Suki changes into that mod. She'll be protective, or aloof, or silly. Really? Do you know the commands? <laughs> I did. Can't remember where I put that piece of paper. Hmm. Do you know what happened to the mirror piece of in the paper baths? Somewhere. Oh, that thing. <laughs> I sorta of hid it a few years back and put a little hairline crack in it. Its days have been numbered for a while. Sorry about breaking it. I feel like- Oh no, uh, don't worry. I'm just glad you didn't get hurt. Mirrors can be very dangerous when they're breaking. In more ways than one. What do you mean? Oh, oh shards of glass and such. Not something to fool around with. Um, don't confirm or deny it, but currently I'm thinking that Miwako did it. Um, and he is, because he likes Miwako, he's helping her out with, like, all the trinkets and stuff and the trickery. Um, something weird happened. When I looked in the mirror, I didn't see my reflection. Because it's not an actual Aha! mirror. 
You know what happened? You're a vampire. Seriously though, that's pretty messed up. <laughs> Maybe you need to get a little rest. <laughs> Seriously this place though. This might be getting to you a little. Is that the portrait from the lobby? Oh, here? Yeah, I'm reframing it. Although it's way harder to do than I thought it would be. It's got a really strange backing. Would you like some help? Have at it. This thing is officially making me nuts. The tools you'll need are near the frame. Okay. I also just realized with how I framed the the thing, black is actually better. It looks like I need to find a way to make sure none of the wires are crossing. Oh, God. Oh, God. This game is so fucking hardcore, dude. I mean, I know we're playing on hard mode, but Jesus Christ. Like, this is legit, like, hard mode. Okay. Oh, this is a- this one needs to be in the center. This one has a lot of stuff connected to it. Oh my god. can't see that. I can see why this thing was driving him nuts. Jesus. Oh, this is a good start. Oh, that looks neat. Okay. Mm, that looks good. Okay. Oof. Oof, oof, oof. Big oofs. There's a lot going on here. I think this is good. This corner is good. God. <laughs> this puzzle hurts me. Yeah, this is a lot. Okay, how... Sometimes some things fall in place and it's like, oh yeah, that makes perfect sense. Oh, like this. And it's like, oh yeah, okay. But then some other stuff, I'm like, how the fuck am I gonna do this? Like my brain trying to wrap my head around this is- I got the backing <gasps> off the portrait. Nice job. Oh my God. I'm a legend. Now what do I do? Certificate of spirit removal. What? Ryokan Hie. What's this? <clears throat> this is to certify that the Ryokan has been cleansed of all malevolent, disruptive, or mischie mischievous spirits, and upon this day is considered fit only for human habitation. Special attention has been paid to all spaces under beds and within closets. These areas have been certified 100% permanently ghost free, even during the middle of the night. Has been duly noted and added to the public record that all spirits previously dwelling in said dom domicile? domicile? are now considered non-resident and shall behave themselves accordingly. At no point will the aforementioned spirits, ghosts, or lurking specters be allowed to return to their previous places of residence without the expressed written, written permission of all human residents in the residence. Savannah Woodham. Savannah Woodham! She did this? I should hold Ooh. on to this article. Sakia. So last night... Is that he, eh? Yumi son. Yumi! 15 years old. Um, Kasumi, 42. In the bathhouse. 
saw something unfamiliar. Kinkyu kyujo taiga dendaku oke genjo ni mukao ga sono doryoku mo. Okay. Couldn't save her. They called. They called emergency services, but they couldn't save her. Oh, Iski Fume. Oh, lost consciousness. So Kasumi? Kasumi lost consciousness in the bath and they called emergency services, but they were too late. Keisatsu wa ken... Jiken to... Jiken to mite. Okay, so they think it's... It's not an accident, so they're opening an investigation into it, the police. Moshi kore ga jiko naraba. Because it might not, it might not be an accident. Can we actually use the dictionary on this? No. Okay, cool. <laughs> oh shit, I've been streaming way too late. Uh, one sec. Okay. Yeah, I need to end stream. I've been streaming way too late. Okay, so we got all of this from that. So that's cool. Okay, let's let's save. End of stream one. Save. Okay, let's let's end it there because I've been going too long. <laughs> it's been so fun. I really like it. I can't wait to play more. Um. I don't know when though. Wednesday? More on Wednesday? You guys okay with that? I'm thinking to this week I'm thinking Monday, Wednesday, Thursday. Yeah, Wednesday. And then tomorrow I'll record more control. So I save, so this should be good, right? Yeah, I'll save again. Just in case. <laughs> I forgot we did that. <laughs> Should have some credits coming up. Yeah! It was such a good day. Also, Tristan, holy shit. Thank you so much. Tristan was MVT MVP today with just crazy bits. Thank you. I do really appreciate what you really don't have to. Thank you so much. Um, thank you everyone for the follows, for the subs, gifted subs, resubs, everything. Thank you so much. I had a great time today. It was really fun just puzzling and having fun. So yeah, we'll finish um, Nancy Drew this week slash next week. So we should be right in, right in time for Mario games next Friday. Um, so no stream on Friday this week. So I'm thinking Monday, Wednesday, Thursday. And then next week we'll probably just be back to normal normal i kind of just make it up as i go though <laughs> but thank you so much for all the support today i really appreciate it and it's just so fun to do yeah mario so we'll also vote on mario next friday so if you wanna we'll determine the order which mario game we'll do first so who knows i don't know what i'll start with um yeah i hope everyone has a great day thank you so much it was really fun and hopefully i'll see you guys on wednesday um, I'll put this on YouTube soon, but I don't know when yet. Maybe like this weekend or something. It won't be anytime super soonish, but because I still I have the shore going up today, I still hadn't even put that one up on YouTube. Um, and of course, there's control going on. There is Legend of Zelda going on, um, and I still have the Skyrim stream. Also needs to find a spot. So it's after all of that, this will go up. I think so. It'll be a little bit. But thank you so much, and maybe I'll see you guys on Wednesday. Have a good day. Bye-bye.